for what a week. Thanksgiving. Yeah. 2020. There's only going to be one of those. Thanksgiving. Everybody that has written in this week, they want to know about your corn dishes. Oh, I even had a couple messages. Yeah. Oh, my corn dishes were good. I had, oh, my corn salad, I we make every year. That was my mom's tradition, and so that is always good. The corn casserole, four ingredients, 30 minutes. It was so good. Really? I would, like, eat that every day. What are the four ingredients? Corn. You should do a can of cream style and a can of regular corn, a cup of sour cream, and a box of Jiffy Mix, and a cup of cheddar cheese. That's more than four ingredients. No. That's The five. corn counts as one. The corn and the cream corn? Yeah, because it's so, corn. Corn, um, sour cream, jiffy mix, one, two, three. That's not how they taught counting at my school. You count with you our thumb with number one. <laughs> corn is corn, whether it's cream style or whether it's whole kernel. It's just um, corn. Hi from Italy. Hi, hi, Allie from Alaska. Hi, Patrick. Patrick's next door. Patrick's next door. Yes, he took good care of me last week. I needed a leaf guard for my pool. Patrick's a good guy. He is a good guy. He found me one. It wasn't even at his store. Well, he always brings our packages, and he bought us Coke Zero. Yeah. And he keeps us, you know, in tune with all that's going on in our little shopping center. We like, we like Patrick. Maria says she wants what I'm wearing. It's cute. You know what? You can get what she's wearing. You can. And it's on sale. Yeah, we wore sale wigs today. Yeah, because we have a really good sale department. Um... They just, they stop making certain wigs in certain colors, or they stop making wigs, and we have a good supply. In fact, the wig I have on is called Izzy, and when they told us they were discontinuing it, we bought a bunch because it is so darn cute. It is cute. Um, I hate to see it go. It's asymmetric all on its own. It has a nice over-directed part, nice tight neckline. Um, This is cute. I mean, right here, because you can either tuck it and show your ear. Ooh, that makes my ear look big. It does not. <laughs> But this is super, super cute. Yeah. This is, and I have on Erin. Erin is technically not discontinued from the company. It's just something we didn't really have room for. So we decided to put it on sale. Mm -hmm. And so this is the chestnut, which is their bright red. Um, if you wear Cory by Noriko, this is kind of like the counterpart to Cory. Um, only it is hand tied and uh, has a monofilament part. Little it's stack in the back. got a cute stack in the back. And the Izzy is machine made. So, you get a good price on both of them. Yeah, we do. We're adding to that a lot. So, always make sure when you go on our website to check our special sale section. Um, like Kim said, sometimes it's just a color. I'm sorry. I don't know what you did. Oh, sorry. I don't know what I did either. Sometimes it's just a color. Sometimes it's a whole style. Um, sometimes things that are discontinued are not on special sale yet because they're still really popular. So, and they'll they'll continue to get some more in. Sometimes. It's just. But, and we're about to add to the... Yes. Discontinued uh, the sale wigs. Mm -hmm. I went through this morning and as soon as I get a chance to instead do Instead of helping Misty, I just created more work for her. That's so I like what I busy do. work. I do. <laughs> it, it, I like sitting at the computer and working. Yes. All right. What else happened this week? Well, we had Thanksgiving. Then we had a busy we week in the shop. Mm -hmm. Everyone that took it, we had a lot of people take advantage of the stuff in your cart sale. Yes, they did. That turned out really good. Um, hi, Gina. Gina is Tina's sister. Oh, really? Yeah, she's she makes Martha Stewart look like an amateur. Yeah, hopefully not the prison part. No, not the prison part. <laughs> she, Aside from the prison, Allie. Gina is the one that sent the angel biscuit recipe that oh, I butchered the first time, but was much better the second time. So I think I, we actually talked about that last week. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we, we made those little chicken... Um, chicken minis. That, yeah. I'm sorry. I love me some Chick-fil-A, but they were better than Chick-fil-A. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, <sighs> anyway. We, we got two people back-to-back -back from the UK. Exactly. Like, one on Facebook, one on YouTube at 12.05. Nice. Eight seconds apart. It said, hi. <laughs> 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 oh, goodness. Well, as you all know, last week was um, kind of... We were in a bad mood. Oh, bad mood? was flat out cranky over this whole aesthetic of thing in fact one lady came in she came in friday like first thing and she goes did y'all get those wigs and i'm like 
at <laughs> one thirty, they came in. Our poor rep. And I was like, I have to see the box because she said she sent it two day air and I'm going to look at it. And, well, she, she did. did. <laughs> she did her part. I felt she bad did her for part. Her. UPS just didn't get it here. So it but, happened. You know, it's the holiday season and it's UPS. I mean, so what can you say? I mean, I shipping mean, you... right now is just tricky and nothing. You know, when we were talking to the rep, it's like, it's guaranteed. Well, nothing's guaranteed right now with shipping. Uh, so, and it's just going to get a little bit trickier with the holidays. So, your mom is watching. Oh, hi, Mama. Hi, Miss Nene. I thought she was going to come see us this morning. But she uh, sometimes I get to see her. If I'm working early, she'll come by, but I haven't seen her in a few days. Yes. So, so we're going to do what we wanted to do last week because we finally have a sample color for the new coffee collection. And I love their ads because it just, it, they put these beautiful cups of coffee and they're all decorated and, and I love that like, and... coffee stain like that whole it has like that round coffee stain mm -hmm. cup I'm like, it just makes me want coffee i love coffee mm -hmm. and when they i mean they can call these collections whatever they john Reno has the chocolate collection that didn't excite me too much i mean i like me some chocolate obviously but not like i love me some coffee yeah. so we're gonna see if these actually remind us of coffee i don't know we showed you the toffee latte last week Did, but i've never had a toffee latte have you I've had a lot of different kinds of lattes. I've had toffee and I've had latte. Oh, speaking of toffee. Have you told Allie about your toffee? Oh, Allie. Kim is famous. No, I'm not famous. She's world famous. <laughs> Will you take what you are because your sister's in Germany <laughs> and she's across the world and okay. she loves your toffee. So T okay, fine. Kim is world famous for her toffee. <laughs> anyway, Allie, I'll share the recipe. It's so good. Oh, Sandy, I'm glad you like your lip scents. It's always, you know, it's always stressful for us when we're trying to pick colors for people. Um, so it's always good. Did we pick colors for her? Huh? Did yeah. we pick colors for her? It says we're kind of blurry. Maybe my glasses need clean. Oh, well, let me tell you what just happened five minutes ago. <laughs> Misty, I set my glasses down somewhere. She did. She, she comes around the corner. She's like, I set my glasses down somewhere. And, 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 she, and she looks directly at me and goes, well, I don't even know where mine are. I'm like... I don't even mind. notice. Yeah. So that shows you the state of both of our brains yeah. today. But that's okay. We both have glasses now in case we need them. Um, so let's do toffee latte. Let's do it. So this is a this is what we had last Good week. Course. You go first. So this is the first color we showed you last week, the toffee latte. We don't even have sometimes they'll put like number descriptions to kind of relate to like the roots and eight or whatever. They didn't do that. So um, it just has a dark brown root with a mid-tone, kind of a dark blonde. Okay, um, I'm going to request to share it in the VIP group. Hopefully, I won't get reported for not following plan, but I'll be happy to post the recipe in the VIP. Well, group. I might report you. Well, you can also delete me. I certainly can. <laughs> okay, toffee latte. The, it's important to mention these, these four colors only come in three of their styles right now. The Finn, the Orchid, and the uh, Avalon. And this is Orchid. Which is the, the longest in the... Oh, I have two Orchids. I love this wig. Yeah, it's pretty. Nice soft waves. Um, we did mention about this whole color melting situation last week. Um, ombre is what it was called back in the day. The newest term, which they change daily, is like color melting. So it is blended really well. Um, this wig's so pretty because it has just a little bit of each and it's not thick. Sometimes that style gets, you know, if you have that curl, it gets really thick down here. That one is not that um, way. This is uh, Orchid's Lace Front with a mono part. Mm-hmm. Can I put it on? Sure. Oh, hi, Julie. Julie's my cousin in Texarkana. Hi, Barbara. Julie. Thank you, Barbara. That's real sweet. Okay, so let, let me do some talking about What are you doing? I'm going to open up. Orchid in Vanilla Macchiato. I had me some macchiato before, usually caramel. I don't know why they didn't call it caramel. I guess because it's white. <laughs> Aesthetica caps are so comfortable. Now, if this were me and I were to buy this wig, the first thing I would do is put some dry shampoo on it. Because mm -hmm. that root is pretty shiny. So if it you... Is. Are not used to watching our videos and you're kind of just tuning in and you're saying oh that looks super shiny we have really bright lights going on and so it does bring up the shine and so dry shampoo will knock that out wow that is a long route it's not oh. as long as mine yeah but it's just more well maybe you're right 
it's pretty that kind of reminds me oh that's really pretty it's just like dark it is dark but it, it it's got these really i don't can you turn the side just a little bit these really honey color dark low lights running through this whereas like even like if you take the john renault's um what's that color that you love palm springs the palm springs it doesn't have this much of a contrast so it kind of is kind of like the palm springs down here but it has that dark it's pretty so we have the same style on right mm -hmm. we look like the lion from the wizard of oz what do you want a heart yeah what does that have to do with our wigs that's what we look like the, the lion, lion? Uh -huh, from the wizard of oz oh did somebody say that oh I, was like, I, where couldn't, they I couldn't make that up. I don't read. I don't read the comments as much as I should because I get so engrossed. I forget to look at the camera. I yeah. like this. I mean, I like it. This root. Um, you've really got to want a darker root like that. Somebody like me that has dark eyebrows because my original hair color is that dark. It does blend in. Um, so a lot of times when people feel like the blonde is too blonde, that darker, longer root really helps. They're saying, please focus. I, it's focused for us. I don't understand. Yeah, we did a focus. Ooh. <laughs> okay. So. All right. You put this on. Here, you're doing more Avalon. Let's do that one. All right. I'm going to do Avalon and Missy's going to list all of the, we're not blurry on YouTube. Missy's going to list all the wigs and colors well, uh, I didn't list the styles, I but our, I did list the colors. Um, but she'll date and time, they're not date, but time stamp them so that you know exactly what was on. Well, one of these days on a video, I, we need to show how you can disrupt that line up there with just a little bit of foundation. Because see how it's really dark? My widow's peak almost shines through a little bit. All right, um, this is Americana. Now, this is interesting. I mean, you got to say, these are colors that nobody else is doing. Yes, I love that. Uh, toffee Latte is a warm tone. Uh, yeah, there's a little bit of auburn in the brown base. That's interesting. I can't quite make out what I see in this. It does have, like, um, a gray tone to it. In some of these highlights, it's very cool, um, but yet the, the, the brown is pretty warm, and the, it's it's pretty. It's not... I, I love how they have the highlights here, which I wish they did that all the way around. You know when people come in, and they've got dark hair, and they, they're like, I just want a little bit of highlight. I want some color dimension, but I've got to keep my dark base. This is going to be a really good color for them. It's pretty. It's definitely different. It is different. I'd like to see that in the sunlight. Well, we don't have sunlight today because it's cold and dreary and rainy. Oh, did you see, Marita, if you're watching, I saw your baby. It was 27 degrees in Florida. Oh, no. Their plants are going to die. What have I done here? There we go. 27 degrees. I'm I gonna, mean, I'm I was freaking out over it getting cold here. And so my friend had all these basil plants. I'm like, you got to get those cut down and I'll make pesto for you. But you can't leave that plant out. And I love me some pesto. I'm not going to die. Have a plug in my diet? Oh, we're going to die. Oh, my goodness, Steve. <laughs> what can you eat? Did you know there's an eyelash there? There's an eyelash? Someone lost an eyelash. It wasn't me. There sure is. All right, so I'm pretty sure this is going to be thin. That's kind of freaky that there's just an eyelash. Yeah, my eyes aren't that big. <laughs> I like this color. I, I like it a lot. I do too. Here's some information. Siri. I like this. I do too. It's, you I see mean, what I'm saying though? How it kind of almost has a gray tone? Yeah. But, it's just super cool. Yeah. I, I, you know what? I agree with you. I'd like to see that in the sunlight. I want this wig. I've never, I've never even tried. <laughs> I'll just simulate it. Yeah, it's just, I don't think you can see it that much better. But yeah, it's it's definitely a cool tone. 
Oh my goodness. I love this journal and everything. Y'all. I keep saying I'm going to get an Avalon. Do you know what I'm about to say? This is my new favorite wig. my new favorite wig. No, it's going to, it's going to take something for Av, um, my Alba. Alba to of course, Alba, Avalon. Maybe it's a sign. All right, I'm putting on Finn in Ice Mocha. So we now have a third company with an Ice Mocha that yeah. none of them look the same. And then we had a discussion in the Facebook group last night. If you haven't joined the Facebook group, it's the Wig Chicks VIP. Um, somebody was just asking what the... That's pretty, too. Yeah, this... Um, it, it has the dark... Not as dark as that, but it's got warmer tones. So you still get that highlight look that goes down lower. It's just... That's pretty. Warm toned. Um, but they were, they were confused because they were, they saw you wearing your Silverstone Hunter. Oh. And then they were commenting about the, they're like, well, so they had typed in Silverstone and it came up in Rico. And so they're like, it, I don't get it. So, you know, you said it was ashy blonde. And so you have to really be careful. So I always tell people, do, do a visual. Look at the visual. Don't go so much by color names because there's a toffee latte. There's a coffee latte. There's Silverstone. There's Sandy Silver. And all these companies kind of carry over. So unless you can specifically see the numbers, which the only companies that really do that are John Renault and sometimes Aesthetica, Aesthetica. then you don't really know. Well, so. the other thing, a good, ex a really good example is Cappuccino and Noriko is just like almost, it's, oh, it's yeah. a very, very, very dark brown. It's not black. And then Cappuccino in Raquel Welch is a heavily highlighted brown. Yeah, it's a cool, you know, really almost blonde tone. Yeah, yeah, it is. So it's very different. I mean, I wear cappuccino over color. I'm not taking this off. I'm just telling you right now. <laughs> it's beautiful on you. And you know why? Someone already commented on your eye color and that you can wear anything. But that cool tone with your eye color is just gorgeous. We get asked this all the time. Do you have something dark with highlights? And they really have not made anything no. across the board. The only one is maybe like the, um, what was that called that I wear? Toffee Truffle by John Renault, which just has a darker base. And then the Coffee Latte by the Renee Paris line, which has, but they're all warm. Nothing is cool like this. What happened to the Toffee Latte? Oh, it's right here. Someone's asking, is the Toffee Latte or the Ice Mocha warmer? The toffee latte is uh, warmer. Yeah. Yeah. It is. Toffee latte. So if you actually, let me hold this up. You turn around and let's show the backs because sometimes it's easier to see the backs. So this is warmer. It's more kind of not as many dimensions as this. This has a couple of different colors running through it. And this is too, but not as much contrast. So definitely warmer. Now, the only thing that I would change about this, which I think is just this wig, is that because the root is so far down, the concentration of the highlight is like at the bottom third or quarter of the wig. So I think it would be cuter if they added a few more up here. But that's, I think, again, I think it's that style. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Allie says it almost looks like a reverse chocolate frost. She's right. Wow. Good call. Yeah. I love it. I love it. But I don't want to try that one. <sighs> I thought you weren't going to take it off. I don't want to. These are all on our website. And like we said, it only comes in, in these three styles. The Avalon, the Finn, and the Orchid. Finn is, I, I believe that Finn is lace front with a machine-made cap. So, yeah, from about here back, it's going to have term, permities, permities, and it's going to be um, a lot more full. So, that's where you see that volume. This lady that was just in here, do you hear her kept saying, she kept saying, I have a five head. <laughs> it just reminds me of the time you laughed at me. Dear Deirdre is asking if we can darken those roots before you ship. And I don't know if you're talking about any roots or the ones that we showed today, because the ones we showed today are pretty dark. Um, but if you're interested in having us do anything like that, just call the store and talk to us. Or you can email at mwidboutique um, at gmail.com. Right, or if you just want to buy that, we sell what we use to darken the root. It's the Style Edit Root Spray, the Root Touch-Up Spray. It's on the website. She's talking about the Americano. Oh, this is Americano, I think. I don't know how you get much darker than that. I don't, yeah, this is really dark. I mean, unless you took black to it, 
you're you wouldn't really see anything she wants to see somebody just said can you hold up the americana to see the back again that's the back oh my gosh this and then is that's pretty. it is pretty and then so you get a better idea of holding it up like this so you see you know they put this caramel piece in there it's just it's a beautiful blend Someone asked, why did Aesthetica go so nuts with those long roots? Some look great and some not so much. They're really doing, I mean, it's fashion, fashion forward things. And like I said, the color melting, whereas it used to be called ombre. <laughs> but um, the color melting is really popular right now in, in the salon and in the, the beauty industry. So I'm really proud of them because across the board, they're the, the first ones to do it. Um, you you'll know this better than me, but aren't they aren't the stylists actually kind of painting? Mm -hmm. A lot of it's about what we so used to be called balayage, so um, just painting in specific areas where the highlight is, like especially like around the face area, and getting it where you don't have those harsh lines from the foil or the spotting from what back in the day when you pulled it through a cap. Um, so it really takes a lot of technique. It's not cheap. Mm -mm. Um, it had someone has to be really good at doing it, or you're going to look like. You know, your five-year-old did it. Um, but they did good. I'm really, really happy with these. Someone's asking about um, Finn and Avalon. Misty has on Finn. Um, Which and... is like Avalon got a haircut. This is going to be um, Avalon. And some of these may be on back order right now. I can't remember which ones she said. Um, but I think they have been really popular for them. Let's turn around at the same time. Yeah, they're just so, so different. So lengthwise, uh, this is shorter, but the mostly shorter in all the layering right here. You know what? This is going to show up to you. You like it? I might have to have this color. No, I want it too. <laughs> no, I think... Um, Shelly Ann must be a hairstylist. She says very realistic for what her clients are asking for mm -hmm. in the salon. Yeah, if you go on Pinterest and just type in, you know, hair hair colors or a highlight colors right now, and what's going to come up is what's popular. And this is this is really what's popular. I can't get on Pinterest. Why? I woke up at three o'clock this morning. I couldn't sleep, so I got on Pinterest and thought, well, I'll just come over here and look at some different ideas and. I thought she meant literally. You couldn't get on there. It was like five thirty. I'm like, well. Time to get up. I know. I'm the same way. Yeah. And I have like all these boards. Every, and it's oh, so Tom funny. Oh, Pharmacy is here. Welcome. <sighs> it's so funny to see like different not diet crazes I was in because I have all these boards. I have Herbalife. I have Paleo. <laughs> I have Keto. I have Weight Watchers. So I'm like, hey, I've already got everything saved. I just have to go back and choose. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I'm into decorating. Yeah, I am too. All right. These are cute. All What's right. Coming up? Oh, not next week, but the week after. You want to talk about it? Sure. We're going to do the 12 days of Christmas. Mimi's version. Mimi's version and Mimi's timing. So if you know anything about the 12 days of Christmas, it starts on <laughs> Christmas Day. But we're not going to do that. We're going to end it on Christmas Day. So we're going to start it on December 14th. And every day we will announce a some some promotion yeah. you know it may be a particular wig that's on sale we you know for we'll do that for 24 hours then we may do a mystery gift um we may tell you what we're putting in but we've got a whole list of things so be sure to stay tuned and that's going to be announced daily so we're not going to give you a schedule ahead of time you got to tune in daily that's right you know what that's saying you know how hard it is for just us to do one video a week we're going to do one every day for 12 days. Yeah, it'll be fun. Maybe it'll discipline us. <sighs> Since we got to put makeup on every day. Mimi, Patty says, Mimi's version, 12 days that are kicky. <laughs> 12, that's right. That's right. But we, I read some articles and some people are like, what's wrong with people? You can't do the 12 days of Christmas till Christmas Day. So if anybody yeah, well, when um, is familiar with that, we we know that we're doing it on a different timing and we're choosing it to do our way. This fan's cute. Yeah, the fin is cute. This it's reminds cool. me back when I had a lot of hair and I had a perm. I'm trying to see if I can pull this What out. else is coming? Is um, I haven't heard of any new styles. Uh, we're still um, getting some back order situations with some of the companies. 
uh, but we're trying to keep really close in touch. If you order something and it's back ordered, we will email you back and you have the option of getting a refund um, or you can wait. Uh, if it's something like Alva, we're going to advise you to wait because as soon as that comes in, I can tell you right now, it's going to back order. Yeah, it already has. I think Alicia's already said that the first shipment is like most of them already spoken for. So yeah. we got lucky on that. And also, if you placed an order during the Thanksgiving sale, if you refund it and it, when it comes in, I mean, you're not going to have a sale price. So my advice is that if you if you order something and I just contacted you, just, just wait it out. Yeah. Um, this time of the year and with COVID, <laughs> I get so tired of saying that. I get tired of that being the answer to everything because it's not the answer to everything. No, it's not. But apparently that's what the world's excuses. I, I think COVID makes them some people a little bit lazy i think so too i might be one of them pamela asked what's the cap on finn yes finn is kind of retro it's a lace front machine made everywhere else so good price point on this one these like i said are on the website shop um as far as back orders i'm not sure what they are i don't think they're very long though i think that when i talked to her she said that they weren't back ordered for very long but we're going to call that out today and get them in stock mm -hmm. which style is easier to cut a bang in this one you don't see gavilon I mean, uh, uh, orchid. Orchid, if you wanted a long one, but this one's already pretty short. You're not cutting a bang in this Avalon. No, I just, I don't think none of them. I think because they all the thing them. is, it's so long that if you start cutting a bang, now you've got a blend, and now you're giving it a whole haircut. You're and you're changing the style so drastically. Bella's asking again. This is the iced mocha, and that is the toffee latte, right? Americana. Americano. This yeah, is the toffee got... latte, which kind of, if you think of toffee, yeah, it does look like toffee. Yeah, and let me put this Toffee other one with one. a nice layer of chocolate. Mm -hmm. And then this is the... Uh, Vanilla. Vanilla macchiato. Somebody noticed that your lip sense matches your top. It does. If you read the description, that's two different colors. She layered boysenberry. Two coats of boysenberry and mm -hmm. one coat of glam doll? No, one coat of boysenberry and... I kind of think it's three coats of glam doll and then just regular glossy. She has to overdo everything. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> One's good. Four's better. <laughs> well, let's talk about me. All right. My lip scents. I did rose quartz, but when I decided to wear that red wig, I had to put a layer of scarlet gloss. So. Yeah, anyway. but that scarlet gloss on that one. Oh, scarlet it, gloss. That changed the color totally. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. um, Deb's asking what color for Finn. I think you would look great in the blonde because you did the gray colors. Um, I think that would be pretty on you, Deb. Yeah, I, I agree. I agree. All right, what else is coming up? Um, um, sea salt spray. If you've ordered that. We ran out almost. I thought we had plenty. We ran out immediately. I did, too. We've got more on the way. It'll be here by the end of the week. Yeah. So if you're waiting on that, thinning shears have been back ordered. They're coming in by Friday. So if you've got that on your order, that'll be shipping, too. Um. I don't know. It seems like all these things that we talk about, we need to mention. Yeah. And then we get on here and can't remember. One of the things we'll be doing the next couple of weeks are head coverings. Yes. So uh, we'll do a review. Uh, we'll review those again because now with winter coming up, there's different head coverings and different things you can do. And so we'll go through some of that. And we'll um, show you the halos again because I think, I think sometimes people forget about the halos. Mm -hmm. And the halos are fantastic. Mm -hmm. So. For sure. All right. Well. I hope everybody has a great week. I hope, I hope so everybody's too. weather cooperates. <sighs> wow, it's only twelve thirty. Really? We got to the point today. Someone will probably still That's walk very in. Very rare. Well they'll still somebody will still write in and go, Why y'all talk so much? <laughs> oh goodness. Everybody, um I think half of the Dolly is still here. Dolly's still here, but she's been. Because... Yeah, I don't. Did we notify whoever got Dolly? Uh -huh. I don't think so. I think it's going to be a surprise because the one who got Dolly, her wig is on order. So, and then um, if you got your your makeup case or what else were we giving away? The, the pink, the pink, the both of the pink mannequin heads got shipped out. Two of the um, makeup cases. We have three makeup cases and Dolly for people that ordered wigs that um, were waiting to come in. So, I can't wait till Dolly gets to her new home. I know. 
I hope whoever got her has um, is on the wig group because post your pictures. That that wig chicks group is amazing. It's I, I just love it, and and we obviously can't comment on everything. But without fail, every day I try to go in there and look at the pictures that are posted and, and answer some questions because there's some uh, there's a wealth of knowledge in there. There are, and people learn from each other. You know um, what I realized? Sometimes they don't even need us. They don't need us. It's like depressing. I thought we were needed. <laughs> no, they don't need us. They they need each other. Mm -hmm. Um. Oh, I was going to say something. Oh, whoever just... Whoever won the dolly and whoever got the two pink mannequins, all of those transactions were done within about 45 seconds of each other. Mm -hmm. And it was all about, about 101 a.m. because at 3 a.m. I woke, I woke up and checked my iPad. 101 or 1201? No, it was 101. So people waited a whole hour? They waited a whole hour. They did. So um, anyway, it was, it was tight. It was, and I, I did get an email from someone. She's like, I guess I didn't win. And I'm like, no, sorry. I mean, she, <laughs> but the thing is, I think she, she ordered like a whole hour early. So she went by her time instead of Central Sandra time. Yeah, no. So it's our time. There'll be more, more uh, contests. Okay. Come. They say we, they do need us. <laughs> <laughs> you know, when I say stuff like that, we just, we just say that to get you. No, I'm just kidding. We don't. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Everybody have a great week. Um, we'll see you next week, and we'll do something fun. I like this week. I know. It's, everything looks pretty on you. No, I'm like, this. somebody said it looked retro. It does reminds me of me back in the day. All right, y'all. All right, y'all have a great week. Bye. Bye.